What's going on everybody? My name is Joe and I want to welcome you to the Goodyear Lounge. Uh, we're going to create a channel that specifically revolves around trading card games, video games, technology, um, and we're going to be unboxing a couple uh, items as well as we go. Um, and so uh, the first unboxed item that we're going to talk about is the GoPro Hero 9. Uh, this was something that we just picked up uh, to uh, record on the go as well as use as a webcam or a stream cam. Uh, we hear that its overall functionality is uh, pretty well, well rounded and extremely versatile as a camera. Um, and so uh, we picked one of these up, uh, GoPro.com. Uh, if you sign up for the year subscription to GoPro, which gives you unlimited cloud storage, uh, you get um, the $200 discount on the GoPro bundle. Um, and so we'll go over the contents as we open up the package. But I want to thank everybody for, for uh, coming in and uh, taking a peek at what this GoPro Hero 9 uh, looks like. And let's get started. All right, everybody, we just want to go over a couple of the high-level tech specs that uh, this GoPro Hero 9 has. Uh, as you can see, we have uh, the GoPro. Um, it is a relatively small uh, device. Uh, the size of a paper clip is shown for reference. Uh, but overall, it has a relatively large front LCD screen. Uh, this is for uh, selfies and things of that nature. Um, it has a built-in microphone and as well as a built-in holding uh, device so that you could easily grip the device uh, from below. If we flip over to the side, it uh, has a couple modes here uh, you could flip through uh, and we'll uh, get into some of those as we unbox the device. Uh, this camera is waterproof. It could go down, I believe it's 33 meters um, if you ever want to go that, that deep. Uh, say you want to go scuba diving, things of that nature, this device can do that. Um, if we look at the back of the device here, a relatively large screen. Uh, it is a touch screen where you access all the settings and things of that nature. Uh, side, this is where the uh, battery um, is held, as well as uh, your SD card. Then if we look at the bottom of the device, this is where the those finger mounts that we saw previously, uh, this mount uh, goes flush into the device uh, when you are not using it. All right, some of the top features we have, we have a 20 megapixel front facing camera. It could either shoot 4K 60 frames per second or 5K at 30, uh, which is pretty impressive for such a small device. Uh, there we go, I misspoke previously. It is 33 feet, not 33 meters. Uh, hyper smooth. Uh, I'm assuming that is going to be your uh, gyroscopic uh, effect that kind of destabilizes or restabilizes your your motion. Uh, Built-in mounting, which you went over previously, uh, it has some slow mo functionality. Um, I'm unsure what data overlays is. We'll have to get dig into what that is. Uh, 1080p live streaming. So if you're connected to Wi-Fi, uh, you'll be able to uh, live stream probably to Twitch, YouTube, anything of that nature. Uh, voice control, we already mentioned that built-in microphone, so you may be able to set the camera down and then say, you know, shoot my picture. Uh, it, it'll, uh, it'll be able to take that snapshot from afar. Uh, scheduled capture, probably very similar. Uh, super, sh uh, super photo and HDR. Uh, HDR, if you haven't uh, played video games or used any technology with uh, high dynamic range, uh, this kind of just adds more of that flourish to color, uh, really broadens that spectrum. All right. All right. So let's get started in opening this box here. And so let's just switch over to. Uh, all right. So here we go. We've got the GoPro Hero 9. Um, it is a relatively small package. Uh, we, again, we got it on GoPro's website. And here we go. All right. That was a good, easy way to open this package. Uh, it is relatively uh, solid. It comes in a carrying case uh, that is relatively small. Um, pretty nice. Uh, definitely, you know, uh, can go with you when you're traveling. Easily fit into luggage or some type of backpack. And so, here we go. All right, so overall it has a relatively nice a uh, little storage section in here. Um, I don't know if that's part of the case or if it's just cardboard. We'll find out here shortly. Uh, but let's get right into the camera, shall we? All right. So looking at the camera, 
it is really small. I mean, looking at the website uh, showing it the size of a paperclip, it is very small, true to form there. So let's do some unpeeling. We have quite a bit of unwrapping to do here. So let's get into that. All right. Pretty weighty little device. I would say this thing, it feels very uh, fit. Could probably take a, uh, a good beating if you drop it. Um, I wouldn't necessarily recommend dropping it, but just in case you have. All right. So that's me not knowing how to open this device. So here we go. All right. All right, here we go. We got all the plastic ripped off. And here is a relatively good shot of the camera. Um, it is extremely small, uh, very well made, seems very durable. Could definitely be a very rugged, uh, rugged little device. All right. Now getting into a couple of the other things that came in this package. So we have a, uh, a mounting clip. Uh, this is specifically for a magnetic mount uh, that came uh, with this device. It has a little bit of a uh, sticky piece, and then it, you can magnetically mount it uh, to a stand. A couple of those pieces. Those are mounting screws. Then it came with a... Uh, I don't believe that this is a stabilizer, but it is a mounted um, device for the camera itself. So you can hold it and take selfies and things of that nature. So you don't have to be holding the small little camera. Uh, it gives you a little bit more maneuverability when you're on the go. Here is the magnetic mount that will unwrap. Here is uh, one battery. As you can see, they're relatively small, so these things charge up pretty quick, I would assume. Here we go. Then we have a USB Type-C connector. Uh, this you can plug into a any type of regular adapter, probably a wall adapter for uh, your smartphone or even a computer, things of that nature. This will be able to uh, charge it relatively rapidly. And so that looks to be it for uh, the case. One thing to note, it is not a built-in uh, compartment. Uh, so this is a piece of cardboard. So definitely want to, you know, possibly um, take care of that. And that may, you know, uh, break into the future. Definitely, you know, if you want to keep this thing nice and safe uh, while traveling, you're going to want to keep that in there or possibly get another type of insert uh, or another type of carrying case if you want to, you know, make sure that nothing breaks. All right, then we just have a whole bunch of paperwork here. Uh, looks like it came with a 32 uh, gigabyte uh, micro SD card. Um, looks like we have some paperwork to install the application on the phone. And you know, the pamphlet on how to use the device, which hopefully everybody goes online and just watches some of their uh, how-to videos. They definitely are very informative and very easy to watch. Um, but outside of that, overall, looks like a pretty solid product. Uh, really excited to get into it and uh, start actually posting some videos with it. So really appreciate it. Thanks a bunch, everybody, and uh, look forward to speaking with you again soon.